hi everyone Habibi here welcome back to my channel in this video I'm going to show you how to add a 360 image uh, inside your oculus app of course if you want to create a 360 scene for example this image I have this 360 image equal rectangular image If you have such image and you want to import it into Unity and show it as an environment of your inside your Oculus, I previously made a tutorial long time ago, few years ago. In that tutorial, I was creating, I, I was using a, a 3D sphere object, and that 3D sphere object has a material, and the material has the albedo map in it, and the image is the texture for that albedo map. Al albedo, uh, yeah, that. and that is not good. I think that is not the right way to do so so that's why I create this tutorial this one will, will be simpler and easier we don't need the three the 3d sphere object at all on that tutorial on my previous tutorial that 3d object should be inverted the the normal face face normal I don't know what is the term normal the normal should be facing inward inside uh, inside the sphere because we are looking at the sphere from inside the sphere we need to see the texture from inside the sphere not from the outside and it is somehow complicated not really complicated but not efficient to do the best way to make it to make the three to show the 360 image or even video is to add a skybox it is very easy here we right click and we create a new material and I will call it uh, 360 image yeah. this material will have this 360 image as the albedo map and of course the material shouldn't be standard material but instead it should be skybox material skybox panoramic very easy and once we have this skybox material 360 image material we can go to window general uh, rendering lighting and environment we can choose that material or just drag and drop it here pretty easy right guys we can rotate around the camera the perspective the view we can see our surrounding pretty easy right that is for the image what about uh, 360 video for the 360 video the technique technically it is same we are using the same material such material as a skybox and we apply it to the scene but one more thing that we need to do is to create render texture because video we cannot we cannot set the video as the texture of the skybox if you don't believe me let me try to track it here it is not possible but it is possible that if we it is possible to create a render texture I will create a render texture I will call it 360 
RT. RT means render render texture stands for render texture. And here is my 360 video. I have this 360 video. It is the, a video I have downloaded from internet, not my video, but I used I used it here just as an example. Let me check the size of the video. The dimension is 4096 2048. So let me edit the render texture here. I need to match the size of the frame width and frame height of the video. 4096 4096 by 2048 2048 then we need a video player object here so forget about the 360 image we have done with it here and let's work on 360 video we need video player game object here we add it and for the video clip we will drag and drop this video file here and then for the target texture we use this target texture that we have made then the next thing to do is to create the 360 video material i will just duplicate this one and rename it to 360 video this one for the, the map I will use this 360 RT or render texture. Then we go to window, rendering, lighting, environment. We use this uh, 360 video render texture, no, 360 video material as the skybox. It will be black screen like this for the first time but when we run the scene the game as long the video is being played we will see the video the 360 video is appearing and we can see sur our surrounding let's play it hang on a second it is very busy so so busy or it is so slow you see that guys but uh, it is very laggy because my computer is not a high-end computer but at least you know that is how to make it the video file is big enough so my computer is slow to load it faster and that's all we are we are able to import 360 image and 360 video and show it inside our scene in unity 3d and we can export it to our oculus app oculus android app let me change it to the 360 image it is better i don't i don't like 360 video it is so heavy you know maybe it's not heavy f to us but to our users some of them will suffer for from the program is being loaded so slow okay guys thanks all for this video so don't use fair anymore if you were watching my previous tutorial i was using 3d fair and it's not good idea use skybox instead bye bye guys see you soon